Hello, I'm here to introduce you to the most advanced self-contained lighting control relay panel on the market today. It's the Lintec RPCR, and it's delivered to you with the control software built right into the controller. It comes with everything you need for a lighting electrical control system, and its programming interface is the easiest to use in the marketplace today, hands down. It's perfect for adding retrofit control to existing electrical circuit breaker panels, the Lintec RPCR has the same control system that we use in our RPC remote controlled circuit breaker panels, which we've been selling since 2009. So this is a time tested proven system. What makes the RPC controller so unique is that it has a web ser server built right into the controller. That means that it is web enabled via an ethernet or an IP connection right out of the box. You simply plug in your network connection, take the IP address off of the LCD screen, Put that IP address into your favorite browser on any browser-enabled device. Of course, your computer and the controller have to be on the same network. Hit enter, and the browser interface is immediately loaded. Once the interface loads, you have a choice of tabs to open. Let me show you. It opens to the status tab, or you can move over to the control tab and start controlling your circuits. I'm sure you can hear that. That's the relays opening and closing as I click the individual uh, relay boxes. You can move to setup and here you'll see another row of tabs where you can play with your password, change your pat password, set up your network connections. There's no software to buy or manage. Everything you need to monitor, set up, or operate your system resides inside that web server on the controller. So what is the RPCR control? The RPCR contains Panasonic latching relays. By having an electrician insert these in between your existing circuit breakers and the electrical equipment that you'd like to control, you can add on-off control to any device that you'd like. For example, lights, AV gear, video walls, video monitors, computers, individual outlets, etc. Panasonic relays come in one or two pole, 20 amp variation, so we can control 120 or 208 volt circuits. Setting up the system as a snap, the entire setup process uses point and click drop down boxes. To illustrate how easy it is, let me set up a zone or two. To set up a zone, simply go to the setup tab, a new row of toe tabs open, click on the panels tab under setup. Now you can see on the far right that we have our zone options. Click on the blue drop down box. You'll notice that this zone is currently disabled. You have two options now. What I like to set up the zone is a grouped zone, which means that the circuits will zip on and off, or would I like to set up the relays to sequence on and off? I'm going to choose sequenced. Now go to the radio button, click it. You only have to engage the radio button, the edit button, to add relays to a particular zone. So now that I've enabled my zone, I simply click on the relay buttons that I'd like to add to the zone. You'll notice that each time that I click on a relay button, that the address bar becomes green. That tells me that I'm, I've successfully added that relay to the zone. You'll also notice that each time I click on a button, a pop-up box appears. This pop-up box enables me to change the order that the relays will trigger on or to change the delay setting between each step in the sequence. So for instance, I can go back and change the delay settings. Once I have my zone set up in the manner that I'd like it to operate, all I have to do is click Save Changes. Now I'm going to go back to my control tab, and is what you're going to notice is that the GUI, the interface, self-populates. So now you'll see that there is a green Zone 2 button. And again, I can still operate my red zone or zone 1 at will. Go back to panels. Now I'll know I will enable zone 3, the blue zone. I'll set this up to be a zip zone. I click on the edit button. And now I'm going to add these. Now, if I want to take a relay out of a zone and put it in another zone, I click on that breaker button and you'll see that I get a warning box. I click OK and you'll see that address 3 turned uh, blue immediately. Now I'll do it with address 6. Again, it warns me and it turns blue. So I've just added two relays from different zones into my new zone. Click Save Changes. And once again, once I go back to Control, you'll notice that the browser interface has self-populated 
and I now have a zip zone. Was that easy or what? This is the easiest system to set up on the market today. Now to operate the zone, you have a number of options. You don't have to use the browser every time you want to turn it on and off. For example, we can go to Setup and set up schedules. All you have to do is enable the schedule, click on the time boxes, change the time. Once we have our new time selected, we'll save the change. We go back to the setup panels page and now I can select that schedule to turn on or off any of my zones. Also, we can set up contact closures. In this case, go to the contact closures tab, choose the input that you'd like to program. You can choose the contact closure style that the controller is looking for, again, through a simple drop down box. Save the changes. Go back to Setup Panels, and we can select that contact closure to turn that zone on or off. IP control, browser control over any smart device or a computer with a browser, contact closure control, including optical or occupancy sensors, and built-in scheduling timers, all included in the onboard controller. No other system has more self-contained control options. In addition, if you'd like to use a third-party master control system to control your RPCR, no sweat. The Lintec RPC controller comes standard with interfaces for IP, DMX, RS-232, streaming ACN, and of course your contact closure inputs. All these interfaces are preloaded. To set up control by a third-party controller, simply go to the Network tab under Setup and select your control options. Note that each zone can be selected to be exclusively controlled by DMX or a streaming ACN. This means that you can control each zone with your preferred control protocol. We're the only controller that offers this as an option. The RPCR also offers multiple built-in global commands. These global commands work across zones to automatically shut selected circuits off on command. This is our load shedding feature. Or we can automatically select individual circuits to turn on, for example, as needed for emergency egress lighting. And we have a brownout feature that can be added that will automatically turn your selected circuits off in case of a power outage or an under voltage condition. And that protects your sensitive equipment. So there it is, the RPCR, the most advanced self-contained relay panel on the market today. The RPCR comes in packages of 8, 16, 24, 32, 48, or 64 relays preloaded and ready to install. It's easy to hook up, easy to install, simple to program and operate. Give us a call at 800-724-4047 or write us at info at if you have questions about the RPCR relay panel. Thank you.